guys and welcome back to a review video slash ideas for Christmas. Okay, now this, this I have never ever done before in my life. As you can see from the title, it is a little bit different of it, what's in my bag type video. But this company got in touch with me, which is Gaston Luger. I'm probably butchering that and I apologise if I am, but I am really bad with names. And they're from Stockholm, Sweden, right? Oh, I've had this box for three days. It has absolutely destroyed me because I've had to wait until now to film the video because I've been too busy with nails. To prove it, it's still not opened. So I'm going to open it now and see what is in this box. I'm going to have to put it down here because it's massive. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's put it this way. I still haven't opened the box. Oh my god, it comes in a bag. I have never had a bag that comes in its own bag. Oh my goodness, I am feeling so posh right now. <gasps> the posh voice really needs to come out, but I'm not. All my bags are from Primark and Matalan and places like that, that, you know, come in a Matalan bag or a Primark bag. Not a bag bag. Do you know, I watch these girls on YouTube and, and they're like, it's spend so much money on these bags and they always come in posh things like this. Oh. oh my God, it's gorgeous. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. Oh, it's even, what's this? Don't even know what that means, but I love it. I love it. Oh my, guys, look at this bag. Oh my God. Oh my god, he's gorgeous! Oh my god, I'm so excited! Oh my god! Sorry, don't usually swear on my channel, but oh, wow! It's even got separation things! Ah! So that pulls out there. Oh, I feel so posh right now. How does this come off? Okay, you pulled it off. 50% of my bags that I have are backpacks because I just love walking with a backpack on. You don't have to, it doesn't fall off your shoulder all the time and it stays on your back. Oh my goodness. So it's light, water resistant, polyester, holds A5 size documents, hidden back pocket. Oh yeah, it's got a little pocket there. I'm gonna take these off and then I'm gonna swap my bags over. Oh, look how long they are. And then you can alter them there if you want to, to be a bit longer, which I do. So let's do that now. How far down shall we have it? I'll have it all the way. Let's see how that looks. And if you know anybody who's into backpacks, because you've got like really different colours on there as well, because I chose this black and uh, pink. I've never seen a black and pink backpack before. Oh, and when, when I got the notifications that it was on the way, I got notifications left, right and centre for telling me where it was. That That is really good for, t um, for keeping you updated. Look at the hardware on this. They are metal rings to hold the straps on. Oh my goodness. These are all stitched so well. So let's go through it before I swap everything over to this bag from my bag. So as, these, if, as they've said, there is a hidden pocket in there and it's got the GL logo in there as well. And that goes all the way down to the bottom. So the front is, a, oh, a press stud open. Oh God, even the press studs are so posh. This material is so nice. There's even like a drawstring in there as well. Let's wait for the coffee machine to finish. Okay, let's carry on. So do the this drawstring first and then that opens up into Two compartments, I think. So you've got one there, and then you've got this Velcro that opens up into another one. Oh my God, you've got loads of room in there. You've got the Gaston Luger name there, stitched in, in the, that this is pink leather, and then that's stitched in there. And then we've got two zips at the front. So one for me phone and one for me easy. Again, because I had it black and pink, the, 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 the draw string things are the draw. The zip draw things are pink. If you forget where you've had it from, their logo's there as well. <laughs> this 
is such good quality you can just tell by looking at it if it starts draining it's not going to get soaked i'm not just saying that i mean i don't get paid for doing reviews as you know so i can literally say what i want but i am so impressed with this bag oh my god it's gorgeous okay, so on to the second part of this video of what's in my bag that i can swap into my new one <sighs> this is going to be fun Okay, this is my bag, which I got from Matalan, and it was on offer for 15 quid. Okay, so the things I've got in my bag are a, a bauble thing and a jigsaw thing. Uh, this I had to move from said place because it sound, every time I picked the bag up, it sounded like I wanted to go camping. So I have a lot of rubbish in my bag, so let's have a look. So I've got e-cig liquid, a clip my purse, a handy little bag, my phone, another liquid, paracetamol, lists to go shopping, two pence, toy blocks, I don't know what they do in there, and another air clip. Oh my good lord, what the hell. This is doing, well, I don't know what that's doing in there, that was from Bailey the last time he got cut. I have a dog bag, plasters, that's stuff to make you go to the toilet. One mask, two mask, a hairbrush, glue, dog treats, a letter from the chemist, filters for when I want to fag and this is a clicker off a pen, medication so I don't forget, chewing gum. So this is all the crap that was in my handbag like ever lightly you know my shoulder hurt I mean what what I don't even know what they're doing in there it's not as if I go in the car and play with them. Most of the stuff can go back to be honest, except the hair clips. This definitely not. Blocks definitely won't. I saw somebody get one of these inside of their bag and I thought that what a good idea to keep receipts in there. So I made myself a little book just so I could jot down anything that I need to and then just keep it in here. The other things in here are, are some more hand sanitizer receipts and more paracetamol tweezers and then the best lipstick I've ever used in my life this is Barry M's it's just 100 and that is literally everything in my bag let's put that in there put the chewing gum in there put the plasters in there and glue some more paracetamol hand sanitizer all right so just to show you how big it is I've got like an iPad here and this should fit in nice and comfortably and there's loads of room in there oh my phone doesn't quite fit in there never mind to put this on this side my brush in there where am i going to put the masks I might put them in the front pockets because obviously we do use them quite a bit. I'm still going to use this because it's pink. And, uh, oh my god, how cute. <gasps> Love it. Alright, so I've just come in a different room. It's even got a top handle as well so you can just hold it with your hand. Um, but I love this bag. I mean, to me, this is the most expensive bag I own now. But to some people who love bags, this isn't very expensive at all. So this, on the site right now, is £95. It is so well made that something like this, that you get what you pay for, will last you years and years and years, guys. Alright guys, well, the link will be in the description box. I'll see if I can get a discount code for you as well. Anything else I've missed out will also be in the description box, guys. But yeah, if you're looking for something like this for Christmas, I would definitely recommend look, looking on this site and choosing from the different colours that they do and the accessories and stuff. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye, guys. <laughs>